때문에 통로를 막아보고 반대쪽에 지금 그랜딩 오픈 다돼 있어 작업이 안 돼가지고 지금 교실 가가지고 네. 하고 그거 그거 때문에 지금 고장 쪽에서 아니 그 침대 쪽에서 철... 220이니까 우리 앞 사면에서 하나 사면에서 똑같이 Everything started early 2005, after Stenotop Management had identified a need to expand the deep water fleet of Stena Drilling. The first thing that happened was that the drilling professionals in Aberdeen developed a design for a topside package. This topside package was developed to give uh, Stena a competitive edge. And once the work was done, we brought this design with us and we approached several shipyards around the world to find out if uh, we could develop a, a suitable platform to carry the topside package. We eventually uh, made an agreement with Samsung Heavy Industries in Korea to build the first vessel. Here at Samsung we are a team of uh, 25 persons working for Stena. Uh, we are directing and leading the construction of the ship from the owner's side. And it's important to make sure that the ship is uh, being constructed in accordance with the applicable offshore codes, standards and to the vessel specification. Leading up to the delivery of the ship on time and in an efficient way and a safe place to work on. The vessel is built to drill at maximum water depths of 3,000 meters and a maximum drilling depth of 11,000 meters. The drilling package is based on a fully hydraulic system, which means that we are using very large lifting cylinders rather than the conventional drawworks and crown block solution. The vessel is basically a shuttle tanker design, a double hull shuttle tanker. The vessel is 750 foot long, which is 228 meters. It's a very wide vessel of uh, 42 meters. We've got six azimuth thrusters, 5.5 megawatts each. And then there's a moon pool through which all the drilling operations are done. And this is 25 meters by 12 meters. The vessel has a capacity for 180 people on board. Propulsion, dynamic positioning, and power generation is secured by a triple redundant system. That means that we have three totally independent circuits of diesel electric power generation and distribution. Each of these circuits is separated by watertight and fireproof barriers, which give us a high degree of safety on board. 얇은 거 하나만 좀. Yeah. are designed to operate in uh, harsh environment areas of the world, uh, all designated areas, including the Norwegian continental shelves. And currently, at the moment, Stena Drilling are the only ones building these uh, type vessels. Currently, our number four ship is under construction here at Samsung Korea and it's fully winterized ship that will be able to operate under Arctic conditions. We have a fully unique uh, hydraulic drilling package and, uh, which incorporates a lot of uh, automation which our competitors uh, do not have. This uh, automation obviously cuts down on manual intervention which makes for a very safe operating unit. The drill max vessels have a high degree of mobility, thanks to the high transit speed. They further have a very high load carrying capacity. This means that we can carry fuel, water, drilling chemicals, and any other consumables on board in great quantities. And this reduces the amount of supply needed at sea, and it increases the vessel's operational endurance. 
the vessels are further designed to the strictest requirements regarding the working environment. That means that we have to fulfill all requirements regarding noise levels, vibrations and illumination. We also need ample space for maintenance work and moving personnel around the rig and also for evacuation if that becomes necessary. So tomorrow's challenges of searching for new areas to explore will be met by the strength and mobility of the Drillmax.